With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, so the question is find the polynomial with the rational coefficients and whose roots are 1 plus minus 2 times of iota comma 4 comma 2. So for this, let's see the solution here. So simply we have to find the polynomial whose roots is given to us that is the roots are 1 plus minus 2 times of iota comma 4 comma 2. So for this what we will say let's say the first root is alpha which will become 1 plus 2 times of iota second root is beta which will be 1 minus 2 times of iota and let's say the third root is gamma this is equals to 4 and the fourth root is delta this is equals to 2. So, now we know one of the thing that is alpha plus beta means sum of root. So, it will be equals to 1 plus 2 iota plus 1 minus of 2 iota. This is equals to how much that is 2, 1 because this both will be get cancelled out. Now, similarly, if we do uh, product of root, okay, so that is alpha into beta. So, it will be equals to 1 plus 2 iota, 1 minus 2 iota. So, it is nothing but a plus b, a minus b. So, it will simply become 1 square minus of 2 times of iota is square. This implies 1 minus of 2 square will be 4. Iota will become iota of square. Now, iota square having the value of minus 1. So, this minus minus get plus. It will simply become 1 plus 4. This is equals to 5. So, we got alpha into beta is equals to 5. Now, similarly, we will try to find for this one also. That is gamma plus delta. It will be equals to 4 plus 2 is equals to 6. And gamma into delta, it will be equals to 4 into 2, this is equals to 8. Now, we can able to form the two equations of uh, order 2. That is, we know x square minus of x in bracket alpha plus beta plus alpha into beta is equals to 0. And for this, we can write down the equation as x square minus of x uh, gamma plus delta plus gamma into delta is equals to 0. On substituting this here, we get x square minus of 6x plus 8 is equals to 0. And on substituting here, what we get x square minus of, okay, alpha plus beta is 2. So, it will be simply twice of x plus 5 is equals to 0. Now, if we multiply this both equation, so that we get the required polynomial here. So, let's say the required polynomial is f of x. So, this will be equals to x square minus 2x plus 5 multiply by x square minus 6x plus 8. Okay. Now, if we multiply this both of them and equate it to 0 so that we get the required polynomial. Okay. So, x square multiply by x square will become how much? That is x raised to 4. Then, x square multiply by minus 6x will become minus of 6x cube. Then, x square multiply by 8 will become 8x square. Okay, then minus 2x multiply by x square will be minus of 2x cube, minus minus get plus 6 twos are 12 times of x into x will be x square, then minus 2 into 8 will become minus of 16 times of x, then 5 multiply by x square will be 5x square, minus of, okay, uh, 5 6 are 30, so it will become minus of 30 times of x, then 5 8s are 40, this is equals to what 0. Now, if we combine the terms here, that is x raised to 4 will be as it is. Now, minus 6x cube and minus of 2x cube will become minus of 8x cube. Then, plus 8x square plus 5x square and 12x square. It will become how much? That is 25 times of x square. Then, what are the remaining here? That is x terms minus 16 minus 30 will become minus of 46 times of x plus constant term that is 40 is equals to 0 and this is nothing but our required polynomial which is asked to find out. So, this is the required solution. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.